Right, I've got an excellent piece of equipment to show you today and it's something completely different. I've been looking for a really good tripod for some time to do my videos and photography and I've come up with this um, piece of kit. So it's made in China by this company here which is a registered trademark company and they make all different types of professional photography equipment. And when I got this set, I got the main aluminium tripod, I got the fluid head separately, and the adapter underneath which secures the fluid head to the tripod. So you can get all these um, pieces or all these um, components separately, and they do various uh, different types of fluid heads, and I actually went for the best one that they had. And that is the PU3501. And the actual aluminium tripod is the PU3003 Professional Heavy Duty Aluminium Alloy Tripod. So the tripod is really ruggedly built and easy to set up. On each leg it has two handles, one here and one below. And these are very well made, nice and comfortable good grips on them and you only have to do that much of a turn to actually extend the leg and when you've extended them it's that much of a turn to actually lock the legs rock solid. And this mode of operation makes this tripod so quick and easy to use you just loosen this handle off and let gravity take the leg down, lock it up and it's ready to use. It's so much better than the old tripods where you had to loosen a lever or clip or whatever and then actually pull those legs out manually by hand. This one is so much better. So now I'll show you the main components. I've unscrewed the fluid head from the bowl adapter and taken the bowl adapter locking mechanism from the underside of the tripod. So that lifts out of the bowl of the tripod. This has a radius on here so that when it locates in the tripod there it can actually swivel around on that ball joint. And that bowl adapter has several different thread sizes in there. I think that's the quarter inch one and that's the three eighths. Several different positions for locating other equipment. And this is the assembly which screws on the underside of the bowl um, adapter. Another well made piece of kit, very rugged. So that one just screws up from the underside. And when you nip that one up, it locks that in that radius in whatever position you want. And it's only a light nip up and it locks it rock solid. And in use is a great method for actually leveling up the fluid head. And there's a spirit level in the back here in which to do so. So you can get that levelling up spot on. The fluid head is an incredible piece of equipment in itself. It's got hydraulic dampening and you can actually see that when I pull the fluid head back with the lever and let go you can actually see it moving itself there on that hydraulic dampening. And to lock that up and down movement there, you have this locking collar here. Nice rugged one again. Nip that one up, 
and that locks that rotation rock solid. And this handle here can actually be located on this side as well. So whatever suits you best. And you can set that in various different positions by undoing this one and moving it into whatever position you want. Tighten that one up. And loosening it, you can actually also swivel the handle either way. So when you actually tighten that one up, it locks the handle in this collar here and actually locks it onto the side of the fluid head. And this lever here locks the quick release plate in position. It can't actually fall out at all with it loosened off, which is a good thing. You have to press the button on this side here and pull it out from the back. And that's got nice rubber cushioning for the camera and the actual mount there can slide up and down. This one's the quarter UNC mount, um, but you can have the uh, 3 8 one in there as well. You just take out this uh, rubber piece here and put the other one in, take this one out or whatever. And it has a nice knurl around there so you can actually get hold of it with your fingers and actually tighten it onto the camera and you can just use a coin to nip it up. And they have actually thought of everything practical when making this fluid head because they say after tightening the screw onto the camera with a coin you can keep the coin safe by placing it on this magnetic absorption plate here so you don't actually lose it. And I saw that information in the instructions on the fluid head. It's very well done with pictures in Chinese and English. So you can see exactly how to use it. So the front of the quick release plate has two chamfers there and it says in with an arrow at the back here so you can only put it in one way. When you slide it in you have to press the button in to allow it to go forward and like I say it can't fall out then. And then you just lock it in position and again it's only just a light lock up to lock it solid. So now I'll just show you some quick shots of me using it in the field um, in a place not far from where I live and you'll see the extended height of the tripod and how smooth it is in panning shots.